Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1869 as a special dedication to Corey. Alright, so it's a time level, so we look from the map screen and we see that the field we're working in is very limited. We've only got three rows, quite a few columns, but only three rows. But we do have a conveyor belt that's going to help us. Now the things that are going to deter us are we've got licorice twirls that are ever present. They'll keep coming out of those gumball machines. And um, what we want to do is access that upper upside down triangle with the popcorn because if we can bust through that popcorn with three hits, not only will we get a color bomb, but there's a whole bunch of um, plus five candies up there. And of course, we're going to try to work low to the ground and encourage cascades because that's how we make plus fives on a board. Okay, so we need to reach 60,000 points within 60 seconds. That's a lot of points. We're going to try to go for color bombs if we can make them, uh, targeting them with individual colors instead of specials because that's our best point boost. So I want to make my moves all the way over here so that they can rotate through. Oh, good. Rotate through and hopefully I'll be able to um, bust through that little area and reach that popcorn. It's kind of tricky. Let's take out all purple. I know I used that pretty early, didn't I? So here's what I mean about the popcorn. I want to strike this three times. Notice this will keep filling in. I don't have the opportunity to... <laughs> I really want to use those together. It's not going to work, but I want to use those together. I don't have the opportunity to strike anything through here because this will just refill. So I want to make my moves either in the central column or over to the left because over to the right it would have to go on the conveyor belt and right here I can then do things like this and really strike that popcorn. I oh, wish I could use that now. Let's get these plus fives going. We need to stay alive. And then, of course, even after the time ticks out, there's a potential of us uh, surviving because we will get points for everything that's on the board that's created but not used. Well, if I can't get to these through the popcorn, I'll do this, right? Now remember, I want an individual colored candy. I do not want to pair that with a stripe because the color bombs beget color bombs and other specials. Okay, I think it's time to take out all orange. We'll access that. And now Oh, I shouldn't have done that. And the reason is, after the game ends, after my time is all up, um, that would have turned into a wrapped candy and popped the popcorn if I don't have the popcorn popped by then. But it looks like I should be able to get this done. Oh, it looks a little laggy. Okay, so that's how I beat this level. Corey, I hope you're just as successful. I hope you get these nice uh, color bomb opportunities. You have to be looking for them, and I know it's so hard. So often, I, um, on a timed level, as soon as I make the move, I think, oh, shoot, I just saw a color bomb off to the side that I didn't capture. And then making these plus fives as often as you can while you're waiting to uncork everything else is important. But I find the biggest trick here is working central column or to the left and avoiding the right. If you want to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.